exclusively here at HSN. Uh, by the way, if you see something that you already own, we'd love to hear from you. <laughs> I'll just talk in between your chops. There He's you actually hacking an animal carcass <laughs> as we speak. You are cutting through ribs, bone. Ribs, right through the bone you if you have to. You are cutting through because bone. Because of the weight and, the, and the, the, the surgical steel. I mean, this <laughs> blade is super, super sharp. But it's also, you can see, it's very durable. It's got a full tang handle. The blade goes all the way through the blade, uh, all the way through the handle, triple riveted. So this gives you the weight and the power to do those chops, to, to chop, slice, dice, you can do it all wow. with this cleaver. If you don't have a cleaver in your arsenal of, of knives in your kitchen, mm -hmm. you really, really need one. And I was just looking at this price, holy cow. Yeah, I just, I uh, mean, uh, let me just really? mention this in case you missed it, it's $14.95 <laughs> for the chopped stainless steel seven inches. This is a champion cleaver. This is already a customer picks. There's lots of rave reviews on our website at hsn.com. All around chef's tool, multi-purpose knife. That's right. It can cut through bone. It's yeah. so nice and wide, you can also use it to scrape oh, yeah. or slice. I mean, disjoint chicken. Uh, I mean, whatever, it goes right through the bone. So you can cut, you know, take the leg bones off of the thighs. You can do the, the tips of the wings. All you do is move the knife and it mm -hmm. cuts, and it cuts right through the bone. Softer bones, I mean, if you're, you know, you don't, you're not gonna do the leg bone of a beef or anything. Okay. <laughs> but for softer <laughs> bones, and not just for meats, okay? You're gonna use this for veggies all the time. I like to show you with the different meats though, because Really, this knife is so sharp. And when you get Whoa. to a bone, because of that solid steel, you can use your hand to go all the way through there, cut perfect salmon steaks for the grill without, I mean, skin, bone, wow. and all. Look at, and again, when you get to the bone, you don't be Done. afraid to use that, the weight of that handle, or the weight of that blade, to do the work for you. How about, and it's less than $15. I thought, I mean, I've seen knives like this, and I thought they were a lot more expensive right, right? than $14.95. But this is from Chopped, and you know, if they're going to put their name on yeah. something, uh, the chefs at Chopped want you to have the very best. If it doesn't chop, it might as well not even have its That's name right. on. But you are like <laughs> I mean, it slicing literally, through a pineapple. It'll cut everything but bad habits and taxes. I mean, really, you will use this <laughs> knife every single day. And for those tougher jobs, I mean, stuff that you normally would have a hard time using a normal kitchen knife, mm -hmm. now now you can use this cleaver to get the job done safe, fast, quick and easy, and everything comes out just like you like it. Because you have the weight of that blade. It does way more yeah. work. I mean, Talk here's about one thing. how important that is to have the right balance well, and, and the full tang construction, which means the metal yes. from the blade goes, goes all the way all into the, way the handle. The blade is not separate, so you don't ever want the blade of a handle to go flying off That's right. while you're chopping or cooking. Very, very dangerous. Plus, it has triple rivets, so it is going to be very secure. This is a really impressive construction. Look at this. I mean, my mother, okay, I, can I can't tell you how many times my mother That's called me into the squash. kitchen to cut squash, and I love squash, all right? <laughs> but, she always said, John, you've been doing this for how long now? Why not make something that will cut squash? Make a, a squash cutter. Well, this is what this does. I mean, that handle, the weight mm -hmm. of the knife, it allows you to cut through those really tough things that normal, you know, normally you would have a hard time doing with a normal kitchen knife. Now you can do it with that cleaver. That's why it's important to have a cleaver in every kitchen so drawer. So impressive. You know, I, I'll be honest, sometimes I just walk past the full whole squashes at the grocery store. <laughs> right. I'm like, I don't know how to cut that. I'm afraid. I don't know if my knife's going to work. And then I end up buying the more expensive pre-cut squash where they probably charge me yep. two or three times the price, right? Uh, I could have cut my own squash at home and saved a bundle. <laughs> you can. I mean, look at this. This gives you the weight, the power. It gives you the control because of that extra thick, extra large, heavy blade. Now, I want wow. you to notice, for delicate work, too, here, let me scoop these up. We'll mm -hmm. put these down here. You kind tree. of also use it like a spatula. Absolutely. You can sort That's of, like, slide a bunch of food on it. one of the best parts about this. That's so if nice. you want to chop up, yeah, even something like a garlic. You want to peel garlic? You can do one or two cloves at a time. Place the blade right, right over the top. Smash. Look, there is your garlic. <laughs> Smash. <laughs> and red, it's already peeled. Look at that. So you pull that out. Now, if you want to mince it, that's the best part about these. You see how that blade does not lay flat on the cutting board? It actually rocks back and forth a little bit. Okay. So for dicing, mincing, it's perfectly balanced for that. And you can do this literally in seconds. And then scoop and serve. Wow, so, you pop, pop it right in the soup pot. <laughs> yeah, right in the soup pot. And then, is it easy to clean? Dishwasher safe. Or I tell everybody, all you need is a kitchen towel. So clean them off. 
Okay. Let them air dry, or you can you can put them in the dishwasher. But I tell everybody with your good kitchen knives, <laughs> don't put them in the dishwasher because that blade is uh -huh. razor sharp, and you don't want that dinging into your no. uh, you know your butter knives and your uh, kitchen plates. But and... if you need a knife sharpener, we have one coming up next. Yep. So stick around. Um,